Hello and thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In this video, I am going to help you get your Samsung Smart TV to cooperate with Netflix. Um, I had this issue that did come up over the weekend and I thought I would share with you what I did to get my Smart TV and Netflix to start working together. So here we go. The first thing you need to do is get to this screen and all you need to do is press that center button in the middle of the remote there, the cube with the colors. Press that button. Also something that I noticed uh, over the weekend, I was becoming frustrated with this um, this little thing and uh, I noticed that every time you depress this thing, you need to point it towards the left side of the, the television in order to get the cursor to move quickly. So yes, pointing the remote to the left side of the television gets the cursor to move rather quickly. When you depress on the letter A on your remote, that corresponds with logging in. So in order to log in, press the letter A on your remote and go ahead and sign into your Samsung account. If you don't have one, here's an opportunity to create one. Of course, um, by habit, we want to point to the screen. Like I said, don't point to the screen, point to the lower left hand side of the, the television and you'll get the cursor to move about rather quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. And I'm just logging in here. Lower left hand side, remember that. And then you want to click on tools. Now on the remote, there is a tools button, but this is what you need to do in order to get Netflix working um, with the Samsung TV. So go ahead and press the tools button. It's at the top left, right above the left arrow. Right above the left arrow there. Click on tools, it'll open another window for you. Here you can either log in and do a couple of other things here, a few other things, but what we need to do is go into settings. So point the remote towards the left hand side of the screen, click on settings. The middle button is the um, OK button, I guess. And then that will open another window for you. And here you have some different options, but scroll down to reset. Click on reset and what this will do is um, it will delete and then reinstall those necessary applications back onto the Samsung Smart TV. It will install or update um, any softwares that your, com your um, television might need also. So give that a moment or so. I think it took all of maybe like two minutes or less. So it'll go through that. I apologize for the video quality. I am taping this with my cell phone. So just a moment longer. At the top right hand screen, you'll see that it's beginning to install some updates. I hope this is beneficial to someone. Um, I was pulling my hair out over the weekend trying to get Netflix to um, respond to this television and it didn't happen until I was like, well, let me just try this thing out real quickly and it did work. So let it go through the installation. And like I said, it does take a couple of moments, so just be a little patient. But at the end, you will have your Netflix looking like this, that log on screen that you want to see right here. And then you can log in. Hope this was helpful. Have an awesome day. God bless. Please subscribe.